Hello everybody, my name is Kashpa and welcome back to my channel today. I hope everybody is doing well. I hope you guys are keeping safe. I hope you guys are taking care. My video today really is to talk to you a little bit about the new Louis Vuitton E-Scale collection that came out about a month ago. The collection really is um, based on a Japanese shibori technique. So it's pretty much where it's kind of like a tie-dye technique. Um, and Louis Vuitton came out in three different colors using that technique. So they used a pastel pink color. They came out with a um, indigo blue color and a, like a reddish pink color. So some really, really fantastic um, colors over there, really good range. And um, I think that they, they were really good in taking the initiative to actually use uh, a lot of their popular products. So you will, if you have a look on their website, I'll try and put it over here as well. So what Louis Vuitton did with um, this new collection is they actually showcased this collection with a lot of their popular products, which I thought was pretty intuitive of them and really great because it's a lot of products that I'm sure you and me and everybody else really, really loves. So some of those products include like the Speedy B, um, the Noé, the uh, Mini Pochette, the Toiletry 26 and uh, many more popular products. So I'll try and put all of them over here so you guys can have a look, but do go over to Louis Vuitton's website and you will be able to see all the different products that they have. So today I really wanted to talk to you or showcase to you some of the products that I've managed to find and um, give you my initial thoughts and um, hopefully this will help you in making decisions on whether or not you would like to buy any of these products. So the first product that I wanted to showcase to you guys and it's probably one of the you know most popular products um, is the mini pochette. So this only came in the one color which is the pastel color. It's essentially the pink color. I'm not quite sure why they just called it pastel but pastel pink um, and um, it's really really cool. So the front is the large monogram and the back you've got the smaller monogram. It's as the normal canvas we've got on the edge here, it's Louis Vuitton is kind of etched in like a silver foil color. I hope you can see that. The uh, hardware is all silver. So as opposed to uh, the other mini pochettes that you will see would be with gold hardware. The inside has this really, really cool like purple lining with Louis Vuitton kind of printed on it. And um, it's just... I think it's fantastic. I really love it. I fell in love with it straight away. It is one of the most popular products, but I I think when it came out, it was one of the first products that I, you know, when the collection came out, I actually wanted to buy. And to the minute it came out, this was the first thing that I went for. And it sold out, uh, you know, very, very quickly. Um, I have actually seen it pop up quite a few times and I've seen it a lot on the pre-love market as well already. But um, it really, really is a stunning piece. Um, you, I think you will really love it if you manage to get your hands on it. Um, because it's such a, a light pastel pink color, I'm not quite sure if there will be sort of any uh, rubbing off on your jeans or anything. But this bag generally is something that people use in their bags as a catch-all or I suppose as a little wristlet if you want to. It really is a stunning bag and... Um, if any, if you wanted to choose one product, I would actually recommend that this be the one. But just to kind of give you a bit of a um, comparison, so this is my Demi Ben. The sizes are exactly the same. There is no difference in sizes. Um, and all the measurements are on the Louis Vuitton website, so please do go have a look over there. Um, as you can see, this one has the gold hardware, whereas this one has the silver hardware. Um, you will find that a lot of the E-Scale collection came out in silver hardware, as opposed to the gold hardware. Um, they look, they feel exactly the same. I don't feel from a quality perspective there is any difference. It's literally from a design perspective. The one thing I will caveat is that this is a lot more expensive than this one. This is just the, the normal classic um, uh, design that Louis Vuitton does. But the, this, for some reason, this collection um, was a lot more expensive. And so that's just something to take into account. One other thing I did want to mention is that I got a little pink liner from Mona Luxury. So do, if you haven't seen my other video where there are seven businesses that I share that you can support, you know, during this really tough time, please do have a look because she makes really amazing products. As you can see, that fits in there like really, really nicely um, and just sips up. It helps keep uh, the bag, you know, nice and full and it helps keep it, you know, protected. So the second item 
that I got is this absolutely gorgeous Zoe wallet. I absolutely love it. I think it's the cutest, cutest thing. Again, it has the silver hardware. The measurements for this are nine and a half centimeters by seven and a half centimeters by three centimeters. Again, this comes in the canvas. It's got the press tud closure. Um, and then if you open it, you pretty much have some card slots over there. So you have two on this side, one, two. The same on the other side, one, two. You have um, upside down, you have the nuts over there, which is great. And then if you love it, you have coins over there. So this is a really, really cute little pouch. It is looks like exactly the same as the other Zoe wallets. The only difference I will say is that it does not have um, a little pocket at the back, which the other Zoe wallets do. But I absolutely love this. I think this is going to be um, the newest addition to my um, everyday wear. I think it's super cute and um, do check it out. And that's the Zoe lot. So the next item that I have is this cosmetic pouch um, and I've got it in the blue color. Um, this also comes in the pastel pink color. The size is exactly the same as the cosmetic GM pouch. I looked at this on the website. The blue is my favorite color so I absolutely had to go for the blue. Um, but I have to say seeing the pastel pink color, um, I just love the pastel pink color. The blue is really amazing. It's absolutely striking. You know, it's really, really a stunning color. Again, you've got the silver hardware. You've got the blue um, tags on the end. The inside is blue, completely washable, just like everything else. Um, well, all cosmetic pouches, but it's you know, a really stunning color and I would highly recommend this one if blue is your color. Um, I think from a price perspective, this particular one is definitely worth it if you look at the price of the normal monogram cosmetic GM. This price is definitely worth it as opposed to the um, Zoe wallet and the uh, mini pochette, which I feel the price is a lot higher. I don't have this in the pastel pink, I just have it in the blue, like I said, but um, do have a look. It really is a stunning, stunning piece. So the last two items that I have, and I was very fortunate to be able to get it in both colors, is the Toiletry 26. Um, looking at both of them, I think between the two, even though blue is my favorite color, I definitely um, would go for the pink color but blue is just as stunning i think it would look really really well with um a strap um this one as you can see so if i turn it this way um you've got the smaller um monograms on the side and the larger in the front and the back okay you've also got on the you've got the silver hardware as i mentioned and um, like on the mini pochette where the Made in Louis Vuitton is in uh, foiled, like in silver, this one isn't, it's just plain. And inside, I say I'm like the cosmetic pouch, it is blue inside, which I just think is great. It's all washable and it's really, really cool. The one thing I do, I did notice when I bought this one was that um, I just found that the sagging over here was really, really noticeable. And I got the pink one afterwards and I don't find, so I don't know if you can see, there is some similar sagging, but I don't think the sagging, maybe because it's a lighter color, I just don't think the sagging is as bad or as noticeable as it is on this one. But I mean, they are both really stunning. You can see them really close together. Um, and I think it's just down to personal preference, like which one you like. I, I do love them both, but I'm kind of erring towards this color. And if I'm going to be keeping the Zoe wallet and the mini pochette, then that might match really well. So just to give you guys a bit of a comparison, I have this monogram um, summer trunks. And um, if you look at the sagging, I don't know if it's just me, but I'm just finding the sagging on this blue one really, really noticeable, whereas on this one, it isn't. Um, what I've actually done with this one is um, I've put in a conversion kit which comes with a little chain which is attached to um, a liner over there and that just means that I can actually wear it as a she can't really see but I can actually wear it as a crossbody and then I would do 
and I just love this. It just works really well. It, it's up to you, but you could actually do the same thing to the swan and then turn it into a crossbody. Um, so you could even wear it as a clutch on your side, but just to give you, I've got some blue on today, kind of how it kind of looks. Um, but still, I definitely prefer the gold um, monogram and most probably the pink. So um, I just thought I'd share with you guys um, my East Girl collection that I have and um, give you guys a bit of comparison between the pastel pink and the blue. I don't have the ready pink one. Um, they also, I know the Kirigami set, I've, um, which I think is stunning. So if you wanted all three colors, the Kirigami set has all three colors. So you have the ready pink in the small version, the medium one comes in the blue and then the pink in the large color. Um, sorry, in the larger size. So um, it's it's literally up to you, but for me, this is one of the best collections of colors or ranges that I've seen. And it's, it's definitely deemed really popular. As always, the quality is really great, but do have a look and check it out. So thanks so much for listening to me. You have a fantastic day and see you in my next video. Bye.